Riding on a school bus just became more eco-friendly in Central Oregon. Today's students from Ben Lapine Schools hopped on the district's first electric school bus. Kelsey McGee tells us more about its addition. The bus will be run out of Silverrail Elementary for two weeks. It will then be rotated to other schools. This is to test its abilities and see where it fits in for its school transportation plan. And the bus is so quiet, it has to play a tune to let people know it's there. This is a little bit of an experiment. I, we are trying to move as green as we can. The Ben Lapine School District's first electric bus was purchased with $160,000 in grant funds. It's from Pacific Power's Electric Mobility Grant Program, along with the Oregon Clean Fuels Program. Elementary students from Silver Rail took a test ride and shared their thoughts on going green. It's very smooth. It didn't make a lot of noise. Uh, and it, it, was, um, it was good to know that you weren't polluting the environment. The brakes don't screech. Like it's smoother and like it's just so quiet. Ben Lapine Schools has 127 traditional buses in its fleet. Most school buses in the country, over 90%, are powered by diesel. And we have over 50% of our fleet is propane already, um, so we would like to be as green as possible. The bus helps to reduce noise and will save the district money on fuel. We did put a charging station on our own lot, but the type of charging system that we have in this, we could charge elsewhere. In addition to providing a lift, the electric bus will also serve as a constant lesson for students. What they're going to do is have some assignments on it. Some of the green teams at the school are, are going to do some studies on it. There's room for 71 students. It'll transport both middle school and high school students. Kelsey McGee, News Channel. 21. Tonight we're asking, would you like to see more electric buses on the road? To weigh in, head over to our web poll on the KTVZ.com homepage. You can vote on previous polls on the polls page. You'll find that under the news tab.